This question, we're about to compute a dot product. However, we can't just use a regular dot product formula because we do not know anything really about the vectors u and v themselves, except their magnitudes and the angle between them. So inside the dot product section of the textbook, we have this formula. Good news is it uses the magnitudes and the angle. Let's go ahead, rewrite this. Now these are all multiplied together, so you could put a dot in between, but it'll probably make you think of the dot product. So just remember these are these three things are multiplied together. So mine are 40 times 90 times cos 2 pi over 3. Uh, whew, 4 times 9 is 36. 100. Cos 2 pi over 3. 2 pi over 3 right here. We want that x value, which is negative 1 half. Ooh, cut that in half. I'm going to guess 1800, hopefully. There we go. So that will be the dot product here.